So I'm going to try something new, something I haven't done really before, a, a video log, I guess you'll call it. At any rate, I've had a lot of people asking me about uh, how I plan on replacing this car, this Lexus size 300 that you can see is missing a whole lot of pieces already. Um, and also this car, this Viper that I've had for about three years, uh, how I plan on replacing those two uh, with something a little different. So I plan on selling all this stuff. So I'm parting out the Lexus. A lot of it's already gone. I still got the motor left, some wiring harnesses, pile of parts back here. Um, transmission, built transmission from ATF Speed. It's sold. Uh, it's boxed. Well, I'm building a box for it, and that's going to go out this weekend. Um, a few other parts, obviously, still. I've got some boxes or some brakes in a box here for. A friend just waiting uh, to send those out. A set of wheels and tires, Supra wheels, uh, Mark IV wheels, obviously. And <clears throat> obviously, we're gonna have to sell this thing. Uh, 96 Viper, like 39,000 miles. It's a fun little car, uh, but gonna be replacing it with something a little, a little more fun, probably. At any rate, I wanna just uh, kind of walk around the garage, show kind of what I've got to work with. Got a Lexus flag up there. A good friend of mine gave me um, for helping him out on a few things. I think he's a little sad I'm getting out of the Lexus game, but it is what it is at this point. At any rate, um, so I placed an order for this car, uh, and it doesn't exactly come all one piece. Uh, just real quick, that's, that's Rocket. He's a very hyper little blue healer, as you can see. And that's Kenzie, the other shop dog. She. She's not the fan of being out here, but she likes to be around people, so here she is. At any rate, um, so I've got this uh, little book here that has a whole bunch of pages of stuff that uh, relate to this new project. Um, so it should be a lot of fun. Uh, it's going to take a long time, and I just want to try to make a little video log of all of the stuff that's going on with it and just try to document it as much as I can. Um, at any rate, so this is my shop. This is the, the garage, rather, and, uh, you know, should be a lot of fun. Um, plan on taking up the whole garage, which is kind of one of the reasons, aside from money, that I've got to get rid of these guys. So anyways, back to uh, back to this. This is, this is the plan, um, at least the, the basics. So Factory 5 builds this kit car. It's called the GTM. It's something I've thought about building for a long, long time, a kit car at least. And uh, finally, just bit the bolt and said, hey, let's do it. Let's get rid of all the rest of the toys and focus on this one. So this is all the paperwork they've sent me with it. Uh, this says you're going to get a whole lot of back-ordered parts eventually. Uh, parts list of what I need. Like six pages. Most of it comes out of a... Uh, like a C5 Corvette. And then the rest of this is literally just parts lists of what comes in all the different boxes uh, from Factory 5. So anyways, quite a lot of work ahead of me. Um, just wanted to, like I said, make a quick intro video and show you kind of what I've got. Uh, as you can see, there's not a lot here yet. Um, these are basically placeholders for me when I start making decisions on some of these parts and equipment that I'm going to be using. Uh, those will go in there. I expect this folder to be a, you know, three or four inch three ring binder by the time it's all said and done. So anyways, subscribe if you want to follow my journey. Um, honestly, the car won't get here till probably the first part of May 2019. Uh, delivery date is the April 27th, but it's still got to get shipped. They build these things in uh, Massachusetts, if I remember correctly. At any rate, questions, let me know. Dogs are making some noise, checking out the old parts. Uh, need any of this uh, parts out of the IS-300? Let me know. Still got a lot of it left. Um, yeah, and that's it.